Bicam's Glyphosate V lateral flow strip test measures total glyphosate concentrations in water and cereal grain samples in less than 15 minutes. The test is designed for field and laboratory use and requires no special training or expertise to obtain accurate, precise results. In this video, we'll demonstrate the quantitative glyphosate V procedure for cereal grain samples. Start by calibrating the Bird 2 Tuck Reader using the barcode supplied with the Glyphosate V kit. For this method, we'll enter barcode A for wheat sample analysis. Oats and other sample types may utilize a unique barcode, which is specified in the instruction poster provided for each kit. Once the calibration barcode is scanned, the Bird 2 Touch Reader is ready for sample analysis. To extract glyphosate from a cereal grain sample, weigh three grams of ground sample into the Virtu Prep extraction tube. Add 30 milliliters of distilled water to the sample in the tube. Replace the tube cap. Invert the tube and shake briefly to wet the sample. Use the arrow button on the Virtu Prep mixer base to set the onboard timer to 120 seconds. Press the Virtu Prep extraction tube onto the mixer base. Twist in a clockwise direction until the locking mechanism engages. Once the tube is in place, mixing begins automatically. The auto shut off feature enables walk away automation resulting in precise and reproducible extraction. Remove the cap of the extraction tube, pouring the blended sample directly into the V filter with cup, allowing filtration until a minimum of 100 microliters is available for next steps. For best results, limit filtration time to 5 minutes or less. Pipe at one milliliter of filtered extract into a strip test vial. Using a new, clean 100 microliter pipette tip, slowly pipette 100 microliters of reagent A to the same strip test vial containing the filtered sample. Reagent A is viscous, so pre-wetting the pipette tip is recommended with a slow and consistent delivery to ensure complete delivery of the reagent. Pipette 100 microliters of reagent B into the same vial containing the sample and reagent A. Close the lid and mix well by vortexing for 10 to 15 seconds. Allow five minutes for this mixture to react. Transfer 100 microliters of derivatized sample to the glyphosate V strip by pipetting vertically into the round sample opening allowing the sample to flow at a rate of about one drop per second. Be sure to transfer all of the sample from the pipette tip to the strip. Set a timer for five minutes, allowing the strip to develop on a flat surface. While the strip is developing, select the glyphosate method from the Virtu Touch Reader menu entering a sample ID when prompted. Open the Virtu Touch Reader sample drawer, placing the glyphosate V strip into the drawer with a circular sample opening facing towards the reader. Then close the drawer and press continue to analyze the test strip. Numeric results will appear on the screen. Your results are now ready for use or transfer using onboard storage 
USB memory storage, or Virtu Connect software, which enables secure data access and sharing within your operation. Thank you. To learn more, contact us today. Thank you for spending time with us learning about glyphosate V for glyphosate monitoring and cereal grains.